getting deeper and you notice it in the color of purple and dark red and it's starting to get its act together. It will slowly strengthen as it pushes closer to the Florida panhandle, likely to make landfall sometime Saturday morning as a tropical storm near Pensacola Beach, where tropical storm watches and warnings are lined up along the Gulf coastline there on the Florida panhandle. Right now, max sustained winds with this tropical low of 48 miles per hour. It's moving northeast at 14 miles per hour. It will have an impact on us here in South Florida as most of the convection is located on the right hand side of the center. So for South Florida, we've got the chance for scattered storms starting late this afternoon and into the evening, especially with heavy downpours. A few of those storms have the potential to become strong and we can't rule out the threat for a few isolated tornadoes, but the main threats will be heavy rain and strong storms with gusty winds pushing over 30 miles per hour at times. All right, Britt.